I'm Dylan Albright. And I'm Matt Goff. And this is No Life Radio. Anyway, so, our first topic of discussion this morning, well, this evening, what time is it? <laughs> it is, well, that clock is 5.44, and that one says 7.30 in the morning, John! 7.30 in the morning, then, John. <laughs> no, stop drinking your vodka, ice. Anyway, right, now... It's Coke! It's not... It's oh, you druggy! It's Coca-Cola. Yeah, but it's red. It's in a... Okay. Anyway, our first topic... Exactly. <laughs> our first topic of discussion is the Russell Mike Brown incident. And Johnny from Ross, don't forget yeah. that term. Who? Like, who do you blame for it? You. <laughs> I don't know. I think it was Jonathan Ross, because... He's the one that... <laughs> yeah. He's the one that started it, isn't he? Yeah. But I, I don't, I think Russell shouldn't have quit and I think he should come back. And I think Jonathan Ross should go die in a hole. No, because Jon- I, I if don't, Jonathan I, Ross Jonathan, died in a hole, shut up. they blame us. And I don't want to die. Jonathan Ross. It's only, it's, 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 five, it's 5.45, it's too early for die. <laughs> <laughs> Jonathan Ross, that was a joke, like, and, 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 and I actually quite like your show. So. Although I do think you should die in a hole. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> it's raining. What? Imagine that. It's, it's not r- raining. It's, it's, it's really rain. dark. Is oh yeah. By the way, if anybody's called Lee Matthews and is listening to this, hi. But that that's Lee Matthews. Lee Matthews who lived down Halls Road, and he knows a Dylan and a mate called Dylan. Well, he, his mum, his mum's named Kelly. We probably shouldn't be saying this, so we're gonna shh now. Anyway, well, we're we gonna, gonna, we got, why are we going to shush? Because we've got to carry on with that radio. Oh, yeah, I was, I meant shh about that. Oh, right. So, have you done, have you managed to land an ollie yet? Yeah. What, what? Are you seeing me? Anyway, oh, I, oh, what okay. I want to okay. ask you, you? Yes. Carry on. Why is there lots of wine in your room? Which we are. There's lots of wine on that stand. Look, listen. You can hear it. It's my grandparents' wine rack. What's it doing in here? I don't know. This is a big it's, it's their wine room. That's a big TV. We have got a 12-inch TV in here, yeah? <laughs> and then we've got a 5-inch over there for the Barbies. <laughs> what are Barbies again? It's those dolls that girls play with, isn't it? Those are girls play with. <laughs> they should put that on YouTube. Um, um, <laughs> um, that last shade is wonky. Uh-oh. Yeah. No, I went to the, um, in Oxford Town. Yeah, um, no, I went to Corrie's to get Tony Hall's Proving Ground, yeah, and it's a 12, and I said to them, what age do you think I look? Don't say five, you're not allowed to say five. Four. <laughs> oh, very much. You're not allowed, no, do I look 11 or over? Do I look at least 12? You look about eight. Oh, seriously. You look about 10, maybe 20. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Twenty. Um, no, I went to the shop to buy it. It's a twelve. I handed it to a man. He said, "Sorry, you can't even buy it." He didn't even ask you my age, the little cow. And he didn't even ask me your age. He's a package as well. I didn't mean that. I didn't say. I said package. Um. Yeah. And well, basically, what happened was I went in. He said I couldn't buy it. I was well pissed. So, <laughs> Um, and then so I just dropped it on the floor and just went into HMV and they let me have it. So, haha, <laughs> Curry, you better not step. You better, you better start letting little kids like me start having them. Otherwise, HMV is going to be much better than you, although it already is. <laughs> uh, well, it is. They had like a rock band. Anyway, tell, tell me the paintball story you were telling me. Earlier. Oh yeah. Anyway, I was in Oxford Street and um, basically what happened? I was in Oxford and these people said that's the. They're called Johnny Rendo. I mean, is that I, a crisp company? It might be. Johnny Renders. Anyway, yeah, this is, that's <laughs> the face of a paper and, um, and then I was, I was unfortunately we were part, um, part of my family. Um, a member of my family. Oh yeah, by the way, if you want to be a member of my family, it's £100. <laughs> <laughs> that's a good one. Um, um, yeah, oh. and uh, she just pulled me away. I was like, oh, but, uh, but, uh, and, then I, and he said, oh, you're the, that's the face of a paintball. I don't want to have a paintball face. <laughs> I want to have a human face. I'm like, 
know. But then, like, then we went into Curry's and, the, and then, mm, yeah. I told you about that. Um, <laughs> right, um, what else? Ladies and gentlemen, I am very sorry about how retarded my, my colleague is. Shut up, what does retarded mean? <laughs> You're a retard. That, that, that is very, very much... That basically... 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 Oh my god! There's a light shade in this room which was in the middle, but then we came the next day and it was at the sky. <laughs> Why? Why? Why did this stuff happen? Why do we even talk about this? We haven't even finished the Jonathan Ross and Russell Brand oh, yeah. conversation. Okay, the whole th that ends with the, the the idea that Jonathan Ross should not have been fired, and the fact. Oh no, Jonathan Ross should have been fired. No offense, Jonathan. He's got a funny guy. head. <laughs> he has. Have you seen his head? But I think Russell Brand should have kept his job, and it's all your fault. It's oh yeah, God. if Mike V hears this, I'm idiot on cam 12, as you and know. I'm not